Hi guys, welcome back. Scanlink here. We're off for more of Undertale in the last episode. We went through Hotland a little bit more, met Sans along the way, and well, we also had another run in with Metaton, who made us become an interviewer or a reporter. But no matter what we reported on, it was a bomb. But with Alice's help, we, we deactivated them all, and now we've made it here to a very weird light struck area and a very webby cave a very webby cave funny that considering that I'm recording this during Halloween even though it probably won't be out at that point did you hear what they just said hello they said a human was wearing a striped shirt would come through uh I heard that they hate spiders. Well, no, I I personally don't like spiders. I think they're creepy, but... I heard that they love to stomp on them. Okay, for me, that is not true. I do not stomp on spiders. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. Okay, that's morbid. I'm out. I can't move! This is terrible. This can only end poorly. I heard. Hello. Um, you were the bake salesman earlier on, weren't you? That they're awfully stingy with their money. You think your taste is too refined for our pastries, don't you, dearie? Uh, well, considering that you were charging it for the maximum worth that my wallet could hold, and I have nowhere near that amount, you kind of didn't give me a choice. Plus, I gotta pay bills. I disagree with their notion. Well, sorry for your prices being outrageously stupid. Even Thames College Fund is cheaper than that. I think your test... is exactly what this next batch needs. No. No, I do not agree. I do not agree! Muffet has trapped me! We are dealing with a freaking bake salesman sentient spider. Anthropomorphic spider, no less. But this music is awesome. This is probably one of my favourite tunes of the game. So. Hmm, this is not good. Muffet, attack 38.8, defence 18.8. Odd, she has a bit of irregularity in her stats. She invites you to her parlour. Excuse yourself. Don't look so blue, my dearie. I think purple is a better look on you. If you ever noticed, oh, up next spiders apparently. You're trapped in a strange purple web, making our soul turn purple. We are going to be stuck on those three lines for the rest of the battle. We can only jump between web strands, basically. That's what our prob that's what we're stuck on, a web, so we have to jump between the strands. Can I say that this music is like a very awesome remix of um, what Napster Blue's theme was as well? It's, like I said, one of my favourite things before I even liked Dummy. So, but now I like Dummy as well. It's like, this game has got such good music, it's unbelievable. Uh, let's see if we can struggle. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet covers her mouth and giggles at you. Rude. Why so pale? You should be proud. Alright, so think of like, Dance Dance Rhythm or Frogger. Yeah, Frogger! That's, that actually makes more sense. Just like Frogger, you want to move up and down, dodging the obstacles. There's just no goal to reach, other than living. Muffet tidies up the web around you. Does she really? You struggle to escape the web. Muffet laughs and claps her hands. Proud that you're going to make a delicious cake. Just want to quickly dodge when needed. You can't hold the button, you have to tap every time. Muffet does a synchronised dance with the spiders. I didn't do that in the tune because I am dumb. I'm going to spare you, Mrs. Sp spider. Blech. Let you go? Don't be silly. I'm not on the ball with the tune today, the tune today, the tune today. The lyrics that people come up for the song, up for the song, up for the song are really good. And now I'm on point, so don't complain about me not being great. 
Hashtag bars. All the spiders clap along to the music, because it's just that rocking. You struggle to escape the web. If you want... Smurfit is so amused to act as she gives you a discount. Now, the thing about money is that if you pay that 10G and you keep paying money, her attacks will do less and less, but it won't end the battle any faster than what you would expect. Fun fact, and I will bring this up now, right before I continue the battle, if you want to skip this battle entirely, make sure that you have a spider donut from the ruins. If you eat it in this battle, the battle will immediately end after you do one turn worth of dodging. I'm not kidding. You could skip almost the entire battle if you eat a spider donut from the beginning of the game. But if you don't have one in stock, well, you gotta go for the long haul, and there's no way you're gonna get another one. Your soul is going to make every spider very happy. More like every monster, but I still have a right to live. That's annoying. We got bouncing donuts. All the spiders clap along to the music. Oh, how rude of me. I almost forgot to introduce you to my pets. It's breakfast time, isn't it? Have fun, you two. So now the box is going to be moving to put you off a little bit more. This seems easy enough. Even though I got hurt by this one. Oh, hello! You're not friendly. Oh, here we go. We, right, now what you want to do is stay on top of the line, basically. We just need to keep climbing this ladder. This is awesome! And no, the game is not lagging. This is how slow it actually runs. Even though you would think it's lagging. Well, it may, it may actually be lagging for me, because I've got Audacity and Hypercam running, so... I mean, I will be going to XSplit soon for, like, the entire thing. No, it was just running slow for the left and right, so I don't know. Muffet does a synchronised dance with other spiders. At least it makes it easier for me. The person who warned me about you... Yes, what about... Ooh, whoa. The spiders and... Don't cross the spiders and the donuts! Smells like freshly baked cobwebs. Ooh. Offered us a lot of money for your soul. Oh, so because I'm stingy, you're just kind of trying to get a better deal. I see how it is. Getting bribed. Ouch. I might need a heal. All the spiders clap along to the music. Sorry, I had to. <laughs> That's probably... Rest in peace, headphone users. <laughs> Speaking of which, I'm wearing headphones as well. They had such a sweet smile, and... <laughs> Who would it be? Oh, hey, whoop. Oh, the boomerang croissant, I see. Yeah. We get Zelda physics. I need an item. We have got instant noodles. We've got a hot dog, and we've also got a hot cat. Let's eat the hot dog, because it's a lot less weird. You ate the hot dog? Your HP was maxed out. It's strange, but I thought I saw them in the shadows, changing shape. Hmm, I wonder who you're talking about. Changing shape, eh? What if it tidies up the web around you? Oh, well that's nice. Thanks for that. Let me just struggle a bit more to make that a bit more of an annoyance for you. You struggle to escape the web. Nothing happened. Oh, it's lunchtime, isn't it? And I forgot to feed my pets. Alright, so here we go again. We got the build-up. Which is easy enough to dodge. I say that and it just started speeding up again for some reason. Thanks, game. Changing speed on me like that. Okay, now we get a change of perspective. Whoop. Whoa. That, looked, that actually looked like I was bugging out a little bit there, because I was too high up. Yeah, the game is definitely lagging when it's doing this, because the music jumped a bit. Interesting. Like I said, though, I've got a lot of stuff. I've got two programs running, as well as the game itself, so... But this game shouldn't really be struggling, to be fair. It's like made in Game Maker and almost any computer can run it. So that's actually kind of funny that it's lagging a bit when I'm recording it. But that seems to be the only time that the game is lagging for me, though. It never lagged on me before, only when I'm recording, so that's still kind of weird. Muffet pours you a cup of spiders. Isn't that cannibalism in your species? Why are you serving me your own kind? That's kind of questionable. And with that money, the spider clans can finally be reunited. What, you're going to be buying some kind of drill to get into the ruins or something? If they're different clans, I'm assuming that's what you're talking about, because that's the way I know. You haven't heard? The spiders have been trapped in the ruins for generations. So I was right. Well, don't worry. If you knock on the door, Toriel might let you through. You may never know. 
Even if they go under the door, Snowden's fatal code is impossible alone. Oh, so you need the money in order to buy jackets. I see how it is. Oh god. Okay, that was bad. I need to heal again. Muffet does a synchronized dance to the other spiders. I need... To go I'm gonna eat the instant noodles. You remove the instant noodles from their packaging. You put some water in the pot and place it on, in, place it on the heat. You wait for the water to boil. It's boiling. You place the noodles into the pot. Four minutes left until the noodles are finished. Three minutes left until the noodles are finished. Two minutes left until the noodles are finished. One minute left until the noodles are finished. The noodles are finished. They don't taste very good. You add the flavour packet. That's better. Not great, but better. You ate the instant noodles. You recovered 8 HP. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that entire sequence happened. <laughs> wow! All that for 8 HP. The hot cat heals more than that. <laughs> Hashtag bars. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, and we're, we're just sitting down with Muffy eating on instant noodles, it's all good. <laughs> Come on, for, you've just been sitting there for five minutes waiting for me to eat my noodles, are you that serious? <laughs> I guess it would be a lot less funny if we were outside a battle because Tom could just pass by, but she's just been standing there for five minutes effectively, that's funny. <laughs> but, <laughs> but with the money you've... <laughs> But with the money from your soul, we'll be able to rent them a heated limo! I, I don't know how to dodge that. <laughs> a heated limo, okay. Oh, that's a lot of stuff to dodge. I'm not going to survive this. I need to eat the hot cat and that's all I have left. I might actually have... Okay, hit me out at me. I might actually get a game over here. And with all thy leftovers, we could have a nice vacation. Or even build a spider baseball field. Okay. God damn it. Well, this seems easy enough. I guess I didn't need a heal. I would have survived that hit. No, I don't want to use that. But enough of that. It's time for dinner, isn't it? Oh yeah, here comes the spider again. I went through that text box a little bit too quickly, actually. I apologise for that. Do, 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 do. Here comes the lag. I should be fine here. At least I can plan accordingly with the lag. Problem is, you got to move a little bit faster this time. Music skipped a bit. Like I said, the game doesn't normally have problems running. It's because I've got two other programs running along with the game is what's causing the issue, because, you know, I've got to how, how else am I supposed to record this? Are you still alive? Oh, my pet, it looks like it's time for dessert! <coughs> huh? A telegram from the spiders in the ruins? What? And they're saying that they saw you and you helped them donate to the cause? Okay, when she says that, it can actually change to you didn't harm them in the slightest, you were a nice guy, if you didn't buy anything. If you do buy something, then obviously it changes the text here, just while I mention it. Oh my, this has all been a big misunderstanding. I thought you were someone that hated spiders. No, I just don't like them. The person who asked for that soy... They must have meant a different human in a striped shirt. Well, there could always be more than one, am I right? Sorry for all the trouble. I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime for no charge at all. I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. Oh, think about that, deal. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll spare you now. I bet next nothing. Well, nice ta doing the tango with you, I guess. Doing the frogger, as it were. We got nothing for that, though, which does suck. That 
this was fun. See you again, Diddy. All right, bye. Um, I'll just walk away with my two HP missing. Thanks for the dance <laughs> and threatening my life. But it's all good because it was all a misunderstanding. It's a poster for Metaton's latest stage performance. Hmm. A tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers kept apart by the tides of fate? Looks like it's almost time for the performance. Hang on. If I go onwards, it's going to be flipping this, isn't it? We just dealt with a boss. we got to deal with another one. Ugh. Oh, and by the way, this is actually kind of a parody to um, a game I've actually done on my channel, actually. One of the... Le okay. One of the Let's Plays that I've done on my channel had such a rough start. And I'm not talking about Earthbound, be Earthbound Mother 2, even though that's pretty much gone even worse than that. And that's... Well, Final Fantasy VI. Oh, the human. Because this is a ripoff of the Opera House. Could it be? My one true love. I don't like where this is going. It's even got the similar sound cues and the 16-bit music engine of the game. It's kind of funny. And they do expect you to dance a marathon as well. I'm not joking. I know it's kind of spoilers because we're just doing it now, but still. Oh my love. Please run away. Monster King. Forbids your stay. Never mind, I'm not allowed to run. I got Humans it. must live far apart. Oof. Even if. It breaks my heart. They'll put you in the dungeon. It'll suck. And then you'll die a lot. Really sad. You're gonna die. Cry, cry, cry. So sad it's happening. Good for you! I like how you've replaced your box with the actual sounds of the game it's of Final Fantasy VI. Because what else am I supposed to do? We're blocked in! <laughs> but I wanted to be quiet for that scene. So sad. So sad that you are going to the dungeon. Well, toodles. Oh, so no matter where I stand, there's going to be a trapdoor. Well, thanks for that. Oh no. Whatever shall I do? Not drop me down here? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh, heavens have mercy. The horrible colored tile maze. That looks familiar. Each colored tile has its own sadistic function. Is this like the full version of what Papyrus broke in Snowden? For example, the green tile sounds a noise, and then you must fight a monster. Red tiles will actually wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle a hundred rooms ago? That is right. You remember all the rules, don't you? So we were supposed to remember all the rules that Papyrus told us. Is that it? You're not even going to give me a refresher? Are you really going to be that evil? Of course you are. Great, then I will not waste your time repeating them. Oh boy. Oh, and you better hurry. Because if you do not get through within 30 seconds... Whoa! You'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. And now you're ripping off Ocarina of Time. Do you want to do any more any more damage? Ah ha 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 ha. Ah ha 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 ha. My poor love. 
I am so filled with grief I cannot stop laughing. Good luck, darling. Oh right, let's just run while he sings. We could, well, down. as far as far as we can, anyway. Now in tears. Oh, poop! Can't go that way. Let's go this way. No, can't go that way. We Made gotta go quick. If only they still knew the rules. What? Oh. Well, the oh, I'm locked. I'm locked in. This ain't A fair. Sorry, try. Now let's watch. I I'm locked in. I can't go downwards. I went the wrong way. Well, I'm dead. That's fun. Ooh, I'm so sorry. Looks like you are out of time. Yeah, but the fire jets didn't get me, so screw you, buddy. I got far enough. Oh, never mind. You're just gonna cheat anyway. Why am I not surprised? Here come the flames, darling. They are closing in. Getting closer. Oh my. Any minute now. Uh, this is too close for comfort. Cough. Hello? Watch out! I'll save you! I'm hacking into the firewall right now. Better late than never, Alphys! Good lord! I'm getting singed! Well, well, they just poof. Oh no. How could this happen? Well, it probably would have happened if I made it to the end anyway, which is quite a difficult feat, so screw me, anyway. Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Elphys. That. That's right. Come on, Metaton. Give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as I, we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now go home and let leave us alone. Puzzle. Over. Alphys, darling, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound. Then you have to fight a monster. Oh, dang. You know, I kind of hate you right now because the green tile was pretty much the only tile I could have stepped on after the first. Well, darling, that monster is me. Fun fact, if you didn't move, it would still fight you. Merton attacks again. Merton attack for a defense 255. His metal body still renders him invulnerable to attack. This is it, darling. Say goodbye. Hello? Is that, is that your phone? You better answer it. Hey, this seems bad, but don't worry. There's one last thing I installed on your phone. Oh yeah? You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's ACT menu and press it. Hmm. Yellow? Boop! My phone... My phone's resonating! This is it, darling. Say goodbye. I has phaser capability now, bitch! Now press Z. Mug? Ooh. Ooh. You have defeated me. How can this be? You were stronger than I thought, etc, etc, whatever. It looks like you beat him. You you really did a great job out there. You installed a phaser on my phone. I am not complaining. I can shoot things for days as long as the battery's still running. How is this still running? Seriously, we like did the jetpack and everything. We deactivated bombs with this thing and it's still got battery. This battery must be like seven times stronger than what any other battery humans have made. What? Oh no, I mean... You were the one doing everything cool. True, but I wouldn't have been able to do it without your equipment. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. And modifications. You can't just shoot po lasers from a program.
Um, hey, this might sound strange, but can I tell you something? But before I met you, I didn't really, I didn't really like myself very much. Ooh, sorry to hear that. For a long time, I f felt like a total screw up, like I couldn't do a anything without, without ending up letting everyone down. Oh, thanks, all look up. But, but guiding you has made me feel. A lot better about myself. So, thanks for letting me help you. No problem. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past MTT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. Alright. Got the nice music again. Yeah, we definitely wouldn't have made that. That's too long. Hello! By the way, if you come back this way, we'll just be back here again. And no, you still can't go up there. But that's kind of cool that they do like a uh, reference. Hey, it's you again. Business is excellent here. These two fellas brought all my ice cream. Oh, I'm you. Have you actually sold out of everything? Sorry. Wait, I still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? Dude, I need some nice cream. Oh. Oh, hey. We're, like, taking a rain check on that killing you thing. Like, don't tell Undyne about this, okay? Seems happy. But if we go down this way, it's this dude again. Hey. Hey. Do you remember my name? Yes. What? You remember? How could I have been so easily defeated? Oh, I always remember that you remembered. <laughs> that face, yo. And guess what? It stays like that for the rest of the game. And you get an achievement. For, you, well, not an achievement, but you get like a sticker or a tarot card on Steam for that as well. Yeah. And if we go in here, we have... Well, it stops the excellent music. But we have now unlocked every lift in... Hotland. So if we choose floor, left floor number one, as we already know, it takes us back to the beginning of Hotland, which means we now have full reign on Hotland. We can skip to whatever lift we have made it to, which is amazing. So we're already coming up to time, and we do have one more cutscene to do if we do go onwards. So I'm actually going to be using this save point right here once again as a checkpoint before we go onwards, and I'll meet you guys back right where nice guy, that nice ice cream guy was. Well, in the next episode. So until then, seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. We're going to end it here, because even though, like I said, there's a save point up ahead, we've got a cutscene right before then that's going to eat up another five minutes or so. So, I think we'll leave that entire area for the next episode. So with that, guys, in the next episode, we will go to MTT Resort, see what's up there, and then, on to the core. See you guys then.